right now I don't have my piggy with me because I'm gonna be using both my hands and I don't want her to run away. So anyway, what I'm gonna be doing today is showing you how to make a no-sew cuddle pouch. So I already have a cuddle pouch for her. It's like green and polka dot, I got it on Amazon. But just for the sake, if you don't have one and don't wanna spend money on it, you can do this. It's an easy way with things that you should have. Okay, so first you need a pillowcase right like this it's old i don't want to use it anymore but i think everybody has a pillowcase at their house and then a blanket you don't want to use again or that's already your guinea pigs um so i'm using this one it's sort of a fleece texture and it's good for her she's used this blanket before so yeah let's get right into the video okay, well before we get started this was not my idea originally I believe somebody else has done it. I'm not sure who, but this is not my idea. I just want to recreate it so you can all see it. So yeah, now let's get right into the video. But before you go, smash that like button and leave a comment down below or email me at piggygals2 at gmail.com if you have any ideas of what I should do. Now let's get right into the video. Okay, sorry, it looks weird that there's this right here because I'm filming it off a table so anyway right here is my fleece slash blanket what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold it twice so first like a rectangle and then you're gonna go and it's gonna look like this a little these are the edges then you're gonna flatten it out and go back to the pillowcase so here's the pillowcase right you're gonna fold the edges a little bit, like that, and you're gonna pull it back. So now you're gonna grab the, a, the corner, like right here, that folds it right here, and you're gonna stick that in to the corner, and then you're just gonna be pressing it in and pushing it in, just so all of the edges are covered in the fleece. So if you're getting picked, accidentally poops in it or poops in it at all you're not going to get it on the pillowcase and it won't seep through so i'm just getting the corners in make sure it's all the way in and if there's really long extra like there's more than this you can always fold it back okay so now with you've done it like this you've tucked it all in you're going to fold the openings to the sides of it so you're gonna do it like that, and then you're just gonna fold it. If there's any extra, if there's not, you can just lightly tuck it in. And then th this is sort of two creations. First one is sort of like a little bed for the guinea pig. And if you want to, you can widen it out. And then, as you can see, there's a nice little bed inside. So now I'm gonna bring my guinea pig out so you can see what it looks like with a guinea pig in it. Okay, so as you can see, this is the size comparison it's very different. <laughs> She's really small. So anyway, she can go here and we'll show you this way and then I'll show it extended. As you can see, she climbed in a little after because she really liked the softness. And now she's just sitting in there and she, I think by the tell, she likes it. But yes, she thinks that I have treats because I gave her a carrot a second ago. Okay, anyway, in the future I will do it be doing many other things but for now we're just gonna start simple and we'll go up as I get better at editing and filming now for the next way you gonna wanna yeah okay she's excited and here is the other way so hope you liked the video again email me with any ideas see you next time goodbye